minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. We've gone for main engine start. We have main engine start. And the shuttle has cleared the tower. up on 10, T minus 10, 9, we have go for main engine start, we have main engine start, minus 3, 2, 1, we have ignition, we have ignition of the solid rocket boosters and liftoff, liftoff of America's space shuttle, and the space shuttle has cleared the tower. Houston now controlling, the mission control confirms roll maneuver started. 20 seconds, thrust looks good. 25 seconds, roll maneuver completed. 30 seconds, Columbia now one nautical mile in altitude. 35 seconds, status check emission controlled by Flight Director Neil Hutchinson, given a go at 40 seconds. Columbia Houston, your go at 40. Roger, go at 40. Yeah, look, Master Arm, and it's the... Uh... 48 seconds, throttling edge down for Mexico. Roger, ignore the master alarm, Columbia. Okay, no. Coming up on train of maximum aerodynamic pressure on the vehicle. Scans of water. We are go for main engine ignition. Eight, seven, six, nine. We have main engine ignition. Eight, Minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. We have main engine ignition. 4, 3, 2, 1. And we have solid motor ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of America's space shuttle on its fourth mission, and we have cleared the tower. Houston now controlling mission control confirmed roll maneuver started. 20 seconds, the rust looks good. 26 seconds, roll maneuver completed. 30 seconds, one nautical mile in altitude, throttling engines down to 65% now as programmed. 36 seconds, plot board status looks good, mission control. 42 seconds, Columbia now three nautical miles in altitude. 46 seconds, coming up on create a maximum aerodynamic pressure on the vehicle. 52 seconds, Columbia now 4 nautical miles in altitude. 56 seconds, pass through Max Q, still looking good, throttling in, giving a go at throttle up. 10, we are go for main engine ignition. 7, 6, 6, we have main engine ignition. 3, 
two, one, and solid motor ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of the first operational space shuttle mission with two satellites on board, and the shuttle has cleared the tower. Houston now controlling, mission control confirms roll maneuver started. 20 seconds, thrust looks good. 26 seconds, roll maneuver completed. 30 seconds, Columbia now one nautical mile in altitude, throttling engines down to 85% is programmed. Mark 40 seconds, Columbia now two and a half nautical miles in altitude, one nautical miles down range. Mark 50 seconds coming up now and create a maximum aerodynamic pressure on the vehicle. 55 seconds, Columbia now four and a half nautical miles in altitude. Mark one minute, pass through max Q, still looking good. Uh, throttling engines back to 100%, giving a go at throttle up. 10, we are go for main engine ignition. Seven, six, we have main engine ignition. Four, three, two, one, zero, and liftoff. Liftoff of the Orbiter Challenger and the sixth flight of the space shuttle. The shuttle has cleared the tower. Challenger's underway with our Three main engines coming down to 81 percent. Velocity 2,000 feet per second. Altitude three and a half miles. Downrange two miles. One minute elapsed. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, we go for main engine start. We have main engine start and ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of STS-7 and America's first woman astronaut. And the shuttle has cleared the tower. Roger your roll, Challenger. Houston now controlling. Mission control confirms roll maneuver starting. Ground time on all F channel 217 20 seconds. Rust looks good. 25 seconds, roll maneuver completed. 30 seconds, Challenger now one nautical mile in altitude. Throttling engines down now to 75% is programmed. 40 seconds, the Challenger now two and a half nautical miles in altitude. 45 seconds, Challenger now three nautical miles in altitude. 50 seconds coming up now and create a maximum aerodynamic pressure on the vehicle. 55 seconds, Challenger, four and a half nautical miles in altitude, mark one minute. Pass through Max Q, still looking good. Throttle in the engine back to 104%. Give it a go at throttle up. T minus 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We have ignition and we have liftoff. Liftoff, 32 minutes after the hour, and the shuttle has cleared the tower. Seven, nine, clear. Roll program. Roger, roll. Houston confirms good roll program. Standing by for main engine throttle down the control structure. Loads on Challenger during max Q, the period of maximum air dynamic pressure. We have go for main engine start, eight, seven, six. We have main engine start, three,
three, two, one, solid motor ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of Columbia and the first flight of the European Space Agency Space Lab. The shuttle has cleared the tower. Roger, roll. Vehicle rolling from tail south around to 35 degree azimuth northeast. Roger. Have a go for main engine start. Six, five, we have main engine start. Three, two, one, zero. We have solid rocket booster ignition and lift off of Challenger and the 10th space shuttle flight. The shuttle has cleared the tower. Tower, pitch program. Houston now controlling, roll maneuver, roll maneuver confirmed. 15 seconds. Good roll, confirmed by mission control. 20 seconds. 25 seconds preparing to throttle down. 75 percent on the main engines. 30 seconds. On. Velocity 700 feet per second. Ten. We are go for main engine start. Eight, seven, six. We have main engine start. Three, two, one. Solid motor ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of Challenger and the first flight to repair a satellite in space. We have cleared the tower. a go for main engine start. Six. We have main engine start. Three, two, one. We have SRB ignition and we have liftoff. Liftoff of mission 41D, the first flight of the orbiter Discovery, and the shuttle has cleared the tower. Roger, roll. Mission control confirms roll maneuver. Standing by to throttle down to 65 percent to begin passing through the period of maximum aerodynamic pressure. Throttling down in a two-step fashion, first 84 percent, then to 65 percent. Throttling down confirmed, 45 seconds. Altitude 3.5 nautical miles, downrange distance 2 nautical miles. Velocity 2150 feet per second. Passing through the period of maximum aerodynamic pressure. T minus 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. Go for main engine start, 7, 6. We have main engine start, 5, 3, 2, 1. 
Zero. We have SRB ignition and the history's largest astronaut crew is on its way. Houston controlling now. All main engines running at 100%. Roll program initiated, 120 degree roll maneuver to uh, put the uh, ship on its 57 degree inclination with the uh, crew heads down and wings level. Throttling down to 92%. Main engine's running smoothly, throttling down now to 65%. Challenger going through the period of uh, max Q of uh, maximum dynamic pressure on the ship. Engine performance still stable. APU is all uh, running smoothly. 13, 12, 11, 10. We're go for main engine start. 7, 6. We have main engine start. 3, 2, 1. And liftoff, liftoff of Discovery, and the first flight to retrieve and return satellites from space, and the shuttle has cleared the tower. Low program initiated, Houston now controlling. Roll program completed. two-step fashion to 89% uh, then to 67% to pass through the period of maximum aerodynamic pressure. Throttle down to 67 confirmed. Forty-five seconds. Downrange distance two nautical miles. Altitude 3.9 nautical miles. Velocity 2200 feet per second. Three engines at 67%. T minus 10 seconds, 9, 8, 7, we have main engine start, 4, 3, 2, 1, ignition, and liftoff, liftoff of Discovery, the first flight, totally dedicated to Department of Defense mission, and it's cleared the tower. Tower clear, the vehicle now turning around to the proper azimuth go down track on this flight. Current height, six-tenths of a mile. All APUs running at normal speed. Main engines, all running at normal pressures. Height, 2.9 nautical miles, distance one mile down range. Release of pre-liftoff water and arming of SRB hold-down ordnance will occur at the T-minus 16 second mark. IMUs go to full inertial at T-minus 12 seconds. T-minus 13, 12, 11, 10, Nine. We have a go for main engine start. Seven, six, and we have main engine start. Four, three, two, one. We have SRB ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of mission 51D and the seven-member crew of Discovery. And the shuttle has cleared the tower. Houston controlling now. Roger roll, Discovery. That uh, 90 degree roll program initiated puts the ship at the uh, proper uh, alignment for flight down the inclination of 28.45 degrees. Throttle step down to 90 percent as uh, Discovery goes through active load limiting in uh, preparation for max Q. Throttle's now down to 65 percent. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. Go for main engine start. 6, we have main engine start. All three engines up and running. 3, 2, 1, 0. SRB ignition and Challenger and Space Lab 3 is airborne and has cleared the tower. Power clear. Houston now controlling. Roll program initiated. 
Roger, roll, Challenger. Minus 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We have booster ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of Discovery, and the shuttle has cleared the tower. Discovery has cleared the tower at that 39, rolling around to the proper azimuth to place the spacecraft on a 28.5 degree inclination orbit. All three auxiliary power units operating at uh, 100 plus percent of their rated RPM of 72,000 RPM. Everything is go. T minus 12. T minus 10. We have go for engine start. T minus 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ignition and liftoff. We have liftoff of Challenger and Space Lab 2. The shuttle has cleared the tower. Tower clear. Roll program initiated. Houston now controlling. They'll be throttling down to 65% uh, throttles on their main engines. Now throttling down. Now at 65%. Uh, Velocity now 1,000 uh, feet per second. Distance downrange to nautical miles, altitude uh, 4.1. 12, 11, 10, 9. We have a go for main engine start. And we have main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1. Ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of A51I and the commercial deploy and repair mission. It has cleared the tower. Roger roll, Discovery. Roll program initiated. Houston now controlling. Roger that. Beginning throttle down now to 65%. Three engines throttling down now to 65%. Three nautical miles. Three engines in the throttle down condition to manage the uh, maximum aerodynamic pressure as the uh, spacecraft approaches uh, max Q at 743 pounds per square foot. The body flap and speed bake in launch position. T minus 12, 11, 10. Have go for main engine start. T minus 6, we have main engine start. Four, three, two, one. 
ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of Atlantis. A new orbiter joins the shuttle fleet and it has cleared the tower. Pro program initiated. Crew confirms roll maneuver. Ten for go for main engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. We have ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of Challenger and the Space Lab B1 mission. And the shuttle has cleared the tower. Houston controlling now. Roll program initiated. Uh, this 102 degree roll uh, puts the ship in the proper attitude for uh, flight downrange and the 57 degree inclination. Houston, the cryo H2 pressure is a deucer. Uh, we're throttling down now for uh, uh, limitation of uh, dynamic pressures on the ship as we uh, pass through the sound barrier. All three main engines are running smoothly now at 65% of rated thrust. Uh, we'll throttle back up momentarily. Minus 10, 9, 9 8. We have a go for main engine start. We have main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. And liftoff. Liftoff of the space shuttle. And it has cleared the tower. Roger, roll, Atlantis. T-minus 10, go for engine start. T-minus 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We have ignition, we have liftoff. Liftoff of Columbia on mission 61C. And the shuttle has cleared the tower. Main engine start, four, three, two, one, and liftoff. Liftoff of the 25th Space Shuttle mission, and it has cleared the tower. Control, 
Start seven six F main engine start three two one zero and liftoff liftoff Americans return to space as Discovery clears the tower. Program. Roger roll Discovery. Crew confirms roll program Houston now controlling. Three engines at one hundred and four percent. Use three good fuel cells. Standing by to be now throttle down to 65%. Engine throttling down now to maintain uh, a certain speed as the spacecraft passes through max Q. Three engines at 65% now. Ending by to see engines begin to throttle back up at about 59 seconds. Mark one minute, velocity 2300 feet per second, altitude 5.9 nautical miles, downrange distance 3 nautical miles. 11, 10, we have a go for main engine start. 7, 6, we have main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1. Ignition and liftoff. Atlantis begins another space voyage as it clears the tower. through maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle. Three engines now at 65%. 11, 10, we have a go for main engine start. Six, five, we have main engine start. Three, two, one, SRB ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of SCS-29 as Discovery clears the tower. Roll, roll, roll program. A roger roll, Discovery. Special Control Houston, good roll program confirmed. Engines now at 65%. Standing by for the go at throttle up call. 
11, 10. We have a go for main engine start. 7, 6. We have main engine start. 2, 1, 0. And liftoff. as the vehicle passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Three engines now at 55%. Velocity now 1,000 feet per second. Atlanta is two miles downrange. Engines now throttling back up to 104% performance. T minus 10, we have go for main engine start. 7, 6, go for main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1, and liftoff. Liftoff on Columbia and its return to flight. This is Mission Control Houston Roll Program initiated. Good roll program confirmed for Columbia. Three main engines up and running. Currently throttling down to 97% and uh, throttling down now to 65% on the three main engines for the passage through maximum dynamic pressure. Altitude 18,000 feet, downrange about one nautical mile. Throttles confirmed by the flight dynamics officer. 11, 10, 10 9, 11, 12, we have a go for main engine start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We have ignition and liftoff of Atlantis and the Galileo spacecraft bound for Jupiter. Houston now controlling. Roger roll, Atlantis. Roll program initiated, about a 110 degree roll maneuver. Guidance confirms a good roll maneuver. Three engines throttling back now to 65% uh, as Atlantis passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Throttles now at 65%, APU's looking good, velocity 2,000 feet per second. Sound suppression water system has started. The launch igniters and pyrotechnics are armed. Nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one, liftoff. Liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery for its Thanksgiving Day mission. Roll program initiated. Guidance officer confirmed a good roll maneuver. Three engines throttling back now to 65% as Discovery passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Velocity now 2,000 feet per second. APU's all looking good. Velocity now 2,300 feet per second. 
T minus 10, 9. We have a go for main engine start. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Booster ignition and liftoff of Columbia. A new decade of space flight begins. Descending from the tower, hand over to Houston complete. Roll program initiated. Roger roll, Columbia. Good roll confirmed as Columbia heads out on the uh, proper launch azimuth for the race to catch LDEF. Good roll confirmed. Now throttling down through 102% for the passage through maximum dynamic pressure. They'll take the engines down to 65%. Three good APUs, three good fuel cells. Three engines now at 65%. Range two nautical miles. Eleven, ten, nine. We have a go for main engine start. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition and liftoff of Atlantis and mission STS thirty six. Mission Control, Houston. Roll program has begun. That program puts the vehicle in the proper launch plane. Guidance officer confirms good roll. Three engines now throttling back as Atlantis passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. The throttle down that reduces the aerodynamic load on the vehicle. Three APUs looking good, all engines looking good. Velocity is 1,200 feet per second. Atlantis now downrange, three nautical miles. T minus 10, go for main engine start. We are go for main engine start, T minus six, five, four, three, two, one, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery with the Hubble Space Telescope, our window on the universe. Mission Control Houston. Roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. The roll maneuver puts the vehicle in the proper launch plane. Guidance officer confirms a good roll maneuver. Engines now throttling back. The throttle down maneuver assists in reducing the aerodynamic loads on Discovery as it passes through the area of not maximum dynamic pressure. Velocity now 1,200 feet per second. Discovery downrange, three nautical miles. T minus 10, nine. We have a go for main engine start. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Ignition and liftoff of Discovery and the Ulysses spacecraft bound for the polar regions of the sun. Roll pump ammunition. Roger roll, Discovery. This is Mission Control. The roll maneuver puts Discovery into the correct launch plane. Guidance officer confirms a good roll maneuver. Engines now throttling down uh, in preparation for Discovery's uh, passage through the aer maximum uh, aerodynamic loads area. Auxiliary power units, all three looking good. Discovery's velocity now 2,300 feet per second. T minus 10, 9. 
We have a go for main engine start. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of Atlantis and crew in the classified Department of Defense flight. Houston now controlling. Roll maneuver underway. Placing Atlantis on the proper heading. All systems performing well. Engines at 104%. Engines throttling down now to help ease aerodynamic loads. Three engines at 72%. Altitude 13, 14,000 feet. Velocity 934 feet per second. Minus 16 seconds, sound suppression water system is armed. 12, 11, 10. Go for main engine start. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3 good engines, 3 good engines up and burning. 2, 1, 0, and liftoff. Liftoff of the space shuttle Columbia and Astro 1 for an insight into the lifestyle of the galaxy. Roll program. Roll program. Roger, roll, Columbia. This is Mission Control Houston now controlling as Columbia ascends through 1,400 feet. Good roll confirmed here on the ground. Three good main engines, three good auxiliary power units, and three good fuel cells. Columbia now at uh, 6,100 feet. Three main engines are now throttling down to ease Columbia's passage through the period of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle. Now at 18,000 feet. Relative velocity now 1,100 feet per second. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Main engine start, three good engines up and burning, 2, 1, Zero and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Atlantis and the Gamma Ray Observatory, seeking out the explosive forces of the universe. Cool program, Houston. Roger, roll, Atlantis. Houston now controlling. Roll maneuver complete. Placing Atlantis and crew in the heads down attitude and on course for its 828 and a half degree inclination orbit. Engine throttling down now to help maintain uh, optimum aerodynamic conditions as Atlantis accelerates through the dense lower atmosphere. Engines throttling further down now to 67%. Velocity 860 feet per second, all systems performing well. Atlantis now beginning to emerge from the uh, region of maximum dynamic pressure. Engines are throttling up. T minus 10, 9, 8. We have a go for main engine start. We have engine start. 3, 2, 1. We have ignition and liftoff of Discovery on a research flight for the Department of Defense. Throttling down. Engine throttle now at 70% rated thrust in order to help uh, maintain optimum aerodynamic conditions as Discovery accelerates through the dense lower altitudes. Velocity 1,000 feet per second, altitude 200,000 feet. Correction 24,000 feet. All systems performing well. Hydraulics, electrical systems performing well. Altitude now 33,000 feet, velocity 1,300 feet per second. T minus 10, 9. We have a go for engine start. 
six, four, three, two, one. Ignition and liftoff of Columbia on the first dedicated medical research flight. Full program, Houston. Ready roll, Columbia. Houston now controlling all maneuvers underway. Maneuver complete, Columbia now heading in a head down attitude on course for a 39 degree orbit. Engines now throttling down as Columbia prepares to pass through the air of maximum dynamic pressure. Columbia now at 20,000 feet, downrange distance one nautical mile. Coming up on a go for auto sequence start. T minus 35. Let's go for auto sequence. And we have a go for auto sequence start. Atlantis four redundant computers have primary control of the vehicle's critical functions. T minus 20. 15. 12, 10, 9, 8, 7. We have a go for main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1. And liftoff of the Space Shuttle Atlantis on a nine-day mission to deploy the Tedris communication satellite. Here's the Atlantis Roll Program. Roger roll, Atlantis. Houston's now controlling. Maneuver complete, rolling Atlantis and crew heads down and on the proper heading. Engines at 104%. T minus 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven. Go for main engine start. Three main engines up and burning. Three, two, one, zero, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery and the Upper Atmosphere Research Satellite. Studying the Earth's environment from space. Roger, roll, Discovery. Mission Control Houston now controlling the flight of Discovery. Roll program complete. Discovery now in a heads down position on course for a 57 degree inclination. Discovery's engines now throttling down as the vehicle prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Three engines now at 67%. Discovery's altitude is now 18,000 feet, downrange from Kennedy one nautical mile. Eleven, ten, nine. We have a go for engine start. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Lift off of Atlantis and the six man crew on a Department of Defense flight. Roger all, Atlantis. Houston now controlling, and Lance is completely rolling over to the proper position for its climb to a 28.5 degree inclination orbit. Three main engines now throttling back to 70% as Atlantis prepares to pass through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure. Eight, seven. We have a go for main engine start. We have three main engines up and running. Three, two, one, zero. 
and liftoff, liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery and the first International Microgravity Laboratory. Houston is now controlling. Discovery and Roo crew are rolling on course. Roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. Roll maneuvers complete, placing Discovery and crew heads down and on the proper heading. Engines at 100%. Engines throttling back now to 70% to help maintain optimum aerodynamic conditions as Discovery accelerates through the dense lower altitudes. All systems performing well. Engines throttled down and performing well. Good, good hydraulics, good electrical systems. Altitude now 23,000 feet. Time one minute. T minus 10, 9, 8, we're go for main engine start, 6, 5, main engine start, 3, 2, 1, and liftoff of the space shuttle Atlantis on a mission to planet Earth. Houston Atlantis in the roll. Roger roll, Atlantis. Houston now controlling. Atlantis is rolling to the proper up sound down position for its climb to a 57 degree inclination, 160 nautical mile high orbit. Three engines now throttling down as Atlantis prepares to pass the air of maximum aerodynamic pressure. Atlantis speed now 500 miles an hour. Downrange one nautical mile, altitude 13,600 feet. One minute since liftoff, altitude now 33,000 feet, downrange three nautical miles, Atlantis now traveling 1,023 miles an hour. T minus 10. We have a go for engine start. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of the maiden voyage of Endeavor on a satellite rescue mission. Houston now controlling, roll maneuver complete. Endeavor's in a heads down position on course for a 28.35 degree orbit. Endeavor's engines throttling down now as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. Endeavor's now one nautical mile from the launch site. Engines now beginning to throttle back up. Ten, nine, eight. We have a go for main engine start. Four, three, two, one, zero. And liftoff of the Space Shuttle Columbia and the first extended duration mission, a stepping stone to space station freedom. Roll program, Houston. Roger, roll, Columbia. Houston now controlling. Columbia is rolled to the proper upside down position, putting the crew with heads down to see the horizon and putting Columbia on course for its planned orbit. Three engines on board Columbia now throttling back to two-thirds throttle as Columbia prepares to pass through the area of maximum air pressure. Columbia's speed now 1,000 miles an hour. Columbia is two miles east of the launch pad, altitude of 4.8 miles and in a steep climb. 
Orbiter body flap and speed brake are in the launch position. Sound suppression water system has started. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, main engine ignition, all three engines up and burning. 2, 1, and liftoff of the space shuttle Atlantis on a mission for new utility in space. Houston's now controlling. Atlantis is rolling on course. Roll program. Roger roll, Atlantis. Full maneuvers complete, placing Atlantis and crew on the proper heading. Engines in full throttle. Engines are throttling back now, helping to ease uh, Atlantis through the dense lower altitudes as it continues to accelerate very rapidly. Engine throttles now at 82%. Atlantis is already traveling over 650 miles per hour. All systems are performing well. Atlantis check hot mic. Engines are throttling back further now to 67%. T-minus 17 seconds. We're coming up on a go for main engine start. 10. TLS is go for main engine start. Have main engine start. Two, one, solid rocket ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of Endeavour on America's 50th space shuttle flight. Houston now controlling. Houston, Endeavour is with you in the hall. Roger, roll, Endeavour. Roll maneuvers complete aboard Endeavour. Orbiter is now in a heads down position on course for a 57 degree, 160 nautical mile orbit. Throttling down now at 67% as Endeavour prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. T minus 10, 9, 8. We have a go for engine start. and liftoff of Columbia on an ambitious 10-day international course for its planned orbit. T-minus 15 seconds. 11, 10, 10 9, yellow, 8, 7. We have a go for main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. And liftoff. Liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery on a seven-day mission for the Department of Defense. Houston is now controlling. Discovery is maneuvering onto course. Roger roll, Discovery. Roll maneuvers complete. Placing Discovery and crew on the proper heading. Engines at 100%.
Discovery is already traveling over 700 miles per hour. Safety inhibits removed. CLS is go for main engine start. Seven, six, main engine up and running. Three, two, one, zero, and liftoff. Liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavor with NASA's newest tracking station in the sky. Hold program, Houston. Roger, roll, Endeavor. Houston is now controlling. Endeavor's on its way and it's rolled to a course due east away from the launch pad for its trip to orbit. Thirty seconds since liftoff. Endeavor's already traveling 450 miles an hour. Altitude one and a half miles. Downrange from the launch pad one mile east. Three engines now throttled back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure. Fifteen. T-minus ten, nine, eight. We have a go for engine start. Six. Five, four, three, two, one. We have ignition. We have liftoff of Discovery on the second mission to Planet Earth research flight. Roll program, Houston. Roger, roll, Discovery. Houston now controlling. Discovery is underway, and it's rolled on course for a 57-degree orbit. Three engines on board Discovery now throttling back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Coming up on a go for main engine start. Twelve. 11, 10, T minus 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Solid rocket ignition and liftoff. Liftoff of Columbia on a voyage to the future. Roll, Roger, roll, Columbia. Houston is now controlling the roll, roll maneuver underway and complete. Columbia is in a heads-down position, on course for a 28.5 degree flight, 160 nautical mile orbit. Engines aboard Columbia now beginning to throttle down as the orbiter passes through the air of maximum pressure on the vehicle in the lower regions of the atmosphere. Columbia is now just one nautical mile downrange from the launch site at an altitude of 17,000 feet. Accelerating now through 680 miles per hour. Twelve. Ten. ten nine. Eight. Seven. We have a go for main engine start. Five. Four. Three. Two. One and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour on the first space have mission and the retrieval of the Eureka spacecraft. Houston is now controlling. Endeavour is rolling on at the proper heading. Roger, roll, Endeavour. Roll maneuvers complete, placing Endeavour and crew on a due east course. Three good engines. Throttle settings at 100%. Main engines are throttling back now, helping to ease loads on the vehicle as it powers through the dense lower altitudes and continues to accelerate rapidly. Engine throttles are now at 72 percent. Endeavor's already traveling over 1,000 miles per hour.
launch ignition system on. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Go for main engine start. Engines are up and burning. 2, 1, 0, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery, launching the next generation of communication satellite technology. Houston now controlling. How'd you roll, Discovery? Roll maneuver complete. Discovery's in a heads down position on course for a 28 and a half degree, 160 nautical mile orbit. Discovery's engines now throttling down as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. The orbiter is one mile downrange from the launch site, altitude 21,000 feet. Ten. Yellow scope for main engine start. Set. T minus six. Five, four, we have main engine start. Three, two, one, booster ignition and liftoff of Columbia on a life sciences mission for Earth and space. Houston's now controlling. Houston, Columbia, roll program. Roger, roll, Columbia. Mission control sees a good roll maneuver, placing Columbia on the proper heading. Three good engines at 100%. Engines are throttling back now, easing Columbia through the dense lower altitudes, but continuing to accelerate very rapidly. Columbia is already traveling over 650 miles per hour. Time 45 seconds. All systems are performing well. All three engines at 67% rated thrust. And we have a go for main engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. And we have liftoff. Liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavor on an ambitious mission to service the Hubble Space Telescope. Roll program, Houston. Roger roll, Endeavor. Houston now controlling. Endeavor's underway. Rolled on course for an orbit with the Hubble Space Telescope. Endeavour already traveling about 300 miles an hour. Altitude one mile. Three engines on Endeavour have throttled back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the shuttle to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Minus 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. We have a go for engine start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery on a bold new era of space flight between the United States and Russia. Roger, roll, Discovery. Houston is now controlling and roll maneuver is underway. Avoid the orbiter. Discovery is now in a head down position on course for 57 degree, 190 nautical mile orbit. Three engines aboard uh, Discovery now throttling down as the orbiter prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. Eleven, ten, nine, 
Eight, seven, we have a go for main engine. Start. Four, three, two, one, and lift off. Lift off of the space shuttle Columbia as NASA continues on the cutting edge of microgravity research. Houston's now controlling. Houston. Roger roll, Columbia. Mission Control sees a good roll maneuver, placing Columbia on the proper heading. Three good engines at 104%. Three engines are throttling back now, easing the buildup of aerodynamic loads as Columbia continues to accelerate rapidly through the dense lower altitudes. Three engines now at 67%. Columbia is traveling over 500 miles an hour at 52 seconds. All systems are performing well. Sound suppression water system being activated. Seven, six, main engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. Zero and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour, observing the changes of planet Earth. Roger roll, Endeavour. Houston now controlling, Endeavour rolling on course for a 57 degree inclination, 120 knots per mile orbit. Endeavour already traveling about 300 miles an hour on a course that will have it uh, go northeast of the Atlantic Ocean parallel to the eastern seaboard of the United States. Endeavour's three main engines now back at two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Minus 10, 9, 8, we have a go for engine start, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, booster ignition and liftoff, liftoff of Columbia on a multi-nation research flight. Hey Columbia, roll program. Roger, roll Columbia. Houston now controlling, Columbia underway on its 17th trip to space. Columbia already traveling 250 miles an hour. Three engines on board Columbia now throttling back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Columbia speed now 700 miles an hour. One mile east of the launch pad, altitude 22,000 feet. V minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Main engine start. Three engines up and burning. Two, one. Liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery, developing new techniques to monitor our Earth's environment from space. Roll program, Houston. Roger, roll, Discovery. Houston now controlling. Discovery is rolling on course for a 57-degree inclination, 140 nautical mile orbit on its 19th trip to space. Discovery speed already 400 miles an hour, altitude 9,000 feet. Three engines on board Discovery now throttling back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure. Discovery now going supersonic. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, we have a go for main engine start, 4, 3, 
two, one, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour on a mission to study the Earth's ever-changing environment. Houston now controlling. Roger roll, Endeavour. Endeavour's roll maneuver is underway. The vehicle's now in a heads-down position on course for a 57-degree, 120 nautical mile orbit. Endeavour's engines are now throttling down as the orbiter begins to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower regions of the atmosphere. Endeavour's altitude is already at 20,000 feet. The relative velocity is 1,000 feet per second or approaching 1,000 miles per hour. Twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven. We are go for the start. Five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Atlantis on a mission to study planet Earth. Roll program, Houston. Roger roll, Atlantis. Houston now controlling. Atlantis is underway on its 13th trip to space, rolling on course for a 57 degree inclination orbit for a highly north and south and climbed orbit at an altitude of 160 nautical miles. Atlantis speed is already 350 miles an hour. The engines on Atlantis are now throttling back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Ten. T minus ten seconds. Go for main engine start. Main engines now started. Engines up and running. Three, two, one, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery on a mission to prepare for the next era of world cooperation in space. Hello, program Houston. Roger, roll, Discovery. Houston is now controlling Discovery on its 20th trip to space. Discovery rolling on course for an orbit with the Mir space station. Mir currently half a world away above the Indian Ocean. Three engines on Discovery now throttling down to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the air to maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Discovery already traveling 700 miles per hour, two miles northeast of the launch pad, altitude four miles. Twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven. We have a go for main engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. We have booster ignition and liftoff of Endeavour on a voyage to view the universe. Houston now controlling. Roll program, Houston. Roger, roll, Endeavour. Roll maneuver underway aboard Endeavour. The vehicle's now in a heads down position on course for a 20, 28 and a half degree orbit. engines have now throttled down as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. Endeavour's already two miles downrange from the launch site, traveling more than 1,000 miles per hour. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. We have three main engines up and running. Two, one, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Atlantis on a mission that will herald a new day of international cooperation in space. Houston now controlling. Liftoff, 
Roger, roll, Atlantis. Atlantis is completing a roll maneuver as the vehicle turns into a heads-down position on course for a 161 nautical mile orbit and rendezvous with space station Mir. Throttling down now at 68% uh, of rated thrust as the vehicle passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Approaching one minute into the flight, the orbiter is downrange from the launch site, three nautical miles, the altitude already up to 40,000 feet. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, main engine ignition, 4, 3, 2, 1. And liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery to complete NASA's constellation of tracking stations in the sky. Houston now controlling the flight of Discovery. Roger, roll, Discovery. Discovery completes the roll to place the shuttle in a heads down, wings level position for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Seven seconds into the flight, Discovery's three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back in a three-step fashion to 67% of rated performance to lessen the stress on the shuttle zero surfaces as it passes through the sound barrier. Fifty seconds into the flight, the main engines now beginning to rev up once again to 104% of rated performance, including the new Block 1 engine. All three main engines performing normally, as are the three power-producing fuel cells and Discovery's three hydraulic power units. 12, 11, 10, 9, we have a go for engine start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Booster ignition and liftoff of Endeavour on the 71st flight of the Space Shuttle on a multifaceted ignition. Houston now controlling the flight of Endeavour. Roger, roll, Endeavour. Endeavour completes the roll to place the shuttle and the down in the water position for the and half minute round of order. Five seconds into the flight, Endeavour's three liquid fuel main engines begin to throttle back in a two-step fashion to 67% of rated performance. That will dampen the stress on the shuttle's aero surfaces as it breaks through the sound barrier. Fifty-five seconds into the flight, Endeavour passes through the sound barrier. The main engines begin to rev back up to full throttle. All of the engines performing normally, along with Endeavour's three power-producing fuel cells and three hydraulic power units. 12, 10, 9, 8, 7. We have a go for main engine start. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And liftoff. The liftoff of the Space Shuttle Columbia catapulting scientific knowledge through microgravity research. now controlling Columbia underway on its 18th trip to space, rolling on course for a 172 mile high, 39 degree inclination orbit. And roll program. altitude 15,000 feet. Three engines on board Columbia are now throttling back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Columbia speed now 800 miles per hour, altitude 34,000 feet, three nautical miles downrange from the launch pad. 10, 9, 8, 7, go for main engine start. 5, 4, 3, 2, one, 
And liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis with the Russian docking module, the threshold to world cooperation in space. range from the launch pad, two nautical miles. Ten, nine, eight, we have a go for engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Endeavour in pursuit of a Japanese satellite. Houston now controlling. Program, Houston. Roger, roll, Endeavour. The roll maneuver is uh, complete aboard the orbiter Endeavour. The orbiter is now in a head down position on course for 28 and a half degree, 250 nautical mile orbit in pursuit of the space flyer unit for rendezvous and capture on Saturday morning. pressure on the vehicle. T minus 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, we have a go for main engine. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we have liftoff of the Space Shuttle Columbia, continuing space research through Tether Satellite Technology. Roger roll, Columbia. Houston now controlling. Columbia rolling on course for a 28.5 degree inclination orbit. Uh, gauge is showing 45% uh, on the left. Roger, stand by. We're showing good output. Tell me we're showing good engines, good commands on all three. Okay, thank you much. Take call with that. All engines operating well on board Columbia. Columbia's engines now throttling down to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure. And that goes supersonic. Columbia's altitude, 29,000 feet. Uh, good engine throttle down and throttling up now. Thousands of gallons of water will be dumped on the launch platform to help absorb the shock of the 7 million pounds of thrust. Nine. We have a go for engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Atlantis on the third shuttle mirror docking flight. back now, helping to ease the buildup of aerodynamic loads on the vehicle as Atlantis continues to accelerate rapidly through the dense lower altitudes, traveling now over 650 miles per hour. Time 48 seconds. All systems are performing well. Atlantis is now easing through the period of maximum dynamic pressure. Range safety command systems are armed. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, Ignition sequence start, five, four, three, two, 
one, zero, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour to develop the practical and the beneficial aspects of space. Go, 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 Houston. Roger roll, Endeavour. Houston now controlling. Endeavour's underway on its 11th trip to space. Currently rolling on course for an east east northeast trajectory away from the Kennedy Space Center toward a 39 degree inclination, 153 nautical mile altitude orbit. Endeavour already traveling 430 miles per hour. Altitude two miles. Three engines on board Endeavour have now throttled back to two thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Endeavour speed now 700 miles per hour, altitude four and a half miles, two and a half miles east northeast of the Kennedy Space Center. Twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight. We have a go for main engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. And we have liftoff of the Space Shuttle Columbia on an international life science and microgravity mission. Houston now controlling the flight of Columbia. Houston, Columbia is in the roll program. Roger, roll, Columbia. Columbia completes the roll to place the shuttle in a head down wings level position for the eight and a half minute line to orbit. 23 seconds into the flight, Columbia's three liquid fuel main engines will soon begin to throttle back in a three-step fashion to 67% of rated performance. That will dampen the stress on the shuttle's aero surfaces as it breaks through the sound barrier. Forty-five seconds into the flight, Columbia already traveling at 711 miles per hour, two and a half miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. The three engines now beginning to rev up to full throttle, 104% of rated performance. Those main engines, along with Columbia's three fuel cells and three hydraulic power units, all functioning normally. 11, T minus 10, 9, 8. We have a go for engine start. 5, 3, 2, 1. We have booster ignition and liftoff of Atlantis on their fourth flight to dock with the Russian space station. Houston now controlling. Houston, Atlantis, roll is complete. Roger, roll Atlantis, Atlantis, and your MPS H2 out message is a deucer only, no action. Copy. The roll maneuver is complete aboard Atlantis. The vehicle is now in a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 160 nautical mile orbit. Three engines uh, aboard Atlantis preparing to throttle down now as the vehicle prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Atlantis's velocity is approaching 900 miles per hour. The vehicle's already two and a half miles downrange from the launch site at an altitude of 6.6 .6 miles. start. We have main engines up and running. Three, two, one. 
Booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Atlantis on a 10-day mission to dock with Russia's orbiting outpost. Houston now controlling the flight of Atlantis. Hard to roll, Atlantis. Atlantis into the roll to place the shuttle in a heads down wings level position for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Thirty seconds into the flight. Atlantis's three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back in a three-step fashion to 67% of rated performance. That will dampen the stress on the shuttle's aero surfaces as it breaks through the sound barrier. Seven. We have a go for engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. Ignition and liftoff. Discovery now on its way to service NASA's Hubble Space Telescope. Houston now controlling. We're all programmed, Houston. Roger all, Discovery. Roll maneuver is complete aboard Discovery. The vehicle's now in a heads-down position on course for a 28.5 degree, 309 nautical mile orbit. Discovery already uh, one, one and a half miles in altitude and downrange from the launch site, uh, one and a half miles as well. Three main engines uh, beginning to throttle down now as the orbiter prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. The three engines now at 67% of rated thrust. Sound suppression water system activated. Rain safety systems armed. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Ignition sequence start. Five. Four. Three. Two. One, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Columbia with the Microgravity Science Laboratory, our research bridge to the space benefits of tomorrow. Roger, roll, Columbia. Houston's now controlling. Columbia is rolling on course toward a 160 nautical mile high. Orbit inclined 28 and a half degrees to our sequator. Columbia already traveling 300 miles per hour. throttle back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Altitude now two and a half miles, one and a half miles east of the launch pad. Columbia is traveling 650 miles per hour. Seven, we have a go for main engine start. Four, three, two, one. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the space shuttle Atlantis, maintaining America's constant presence in space. Houston now controlling the side of Atlantis. Uh, yeah, I was the roll program. Roger, roll, Atlantis. Echoing the words of Yuri Gagarin on his launch 36 years ago, Commander Charlie Precourt puts Atlantis into the roll, heads down, wings level for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Mike Fall headed to the Mir space station. Thirty seconds into the flight, Atlantis's three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back in a three-step fashion to 67% of rated performance to dampen the stress on the shuttle's aero surfaces as it breaks through the sound barrier. Fifty-three seconds into the flight, the main engines now beginning to rev up to full throttle, 104% of rated performance. The engines, along with the three fuel cells and three auxiliary power units, all functioning normally. T minus ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Main engine start. Three, two, one. 
zero and liftoff of Columbia with the Microgravity Science Laboratory, a research bridge to the International Space Station. Uh, Houston. Roger, roll, Columbia. Houston is now controlling. Roll maneuver is uh, complete aboard Columbia. The orbiter is now in a heads down position on course for a 28 and a half degree, 160 nautical mile orbit. Now at 30 seconds, the uh, three engines aboard the orbiter will begin uh, throttling down as the vehicle prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle. Having just passed through that area of maximum dynamic pressure, the three engines are preparing to begin a throttle back up. We have a go for main engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery on a mission to study planet Earth. Houston is now controlling. The roll maneuver is complete. Discovery is now in a head down, leaving level position. Thirty-four seconds into Discovery's eight and a half minute climb to orbit this morning. All three main engines now throttling down to 67% of rated thrust as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower regions of the Earth's atmosphere. Telemetry indicates all three auxiliary power units and fuel cells continuing to perform well. Discovery now downrange from the Kennedy Space Center, three and a half miles at an altitude of about seven miles. Twelve, eleven, ten, nine. Eight, seven. We have a go for main engine. Five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of the space shuttle Atlantis, extending America's presence in space while opening new chapters in exploration. Houston now controlling. Houston now controlling. Rolling roll program initiated to place Atlantis on its heads down track over the Atlantic. Engines at 104 percent, preparing to throttle down to 67 percent for max Q, passing through the period of maximum aerodynamic pressure on the vehicle. Three engines throttling down now. Three engines at 67. Minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Start. 5, 3, 2, 1. And liftoff of Space Shuttle Columbia on a mission combining science and the practical aspects of space. Roger, roll, Columbia. Future not controlling. Well, complete. Columbia now in a heads down wings level position headed to a 150 nautical mile orbit, inclined 20 and a half degrees to either side of the equator. Three engines on board Columbia now traveling back to the 67% of rate of thrust as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure in the lower part of Earth's atmosphere. Minus 13 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. We have a go. Main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1.
We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour, continuing the union of U.S. and Russian space endeavors. This is Endeavour roll program. Roger, roll Endeavour. Houston is now controlling. The roll maneuver is complete. Endeavour is now in a heads down, wings level position, headed to a rendezvous with the Mir space station. seconds into flight. Endeavour now traveling at about 520 miles per hour. Endeavour's engines are now throttling down to 67% of rated thrust. Endeavour is now passing through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. Downrange from the Kennedy Space Center, 2.3 miles, traveling at a speed of just about 870 miles per hour. T minus 10 seconds. Hello. 9, 8, 7. Go from 8 engines. Start at 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And liftoff of Space Shuttle Columbia on a mission expanding our knowledge and understanding of the human nervous system. Roger roll, Columbia. Columbia into the roll, placing the shuttle in a heads-down, wings-level position for the eight-and-a-half-minute ride to orbit. Twenty-five seconds into the flight. Columbia one mile in altitude, two miles downrange. At the 45-second mark, Columbia's three liquid fuel main engines now throttle back in a three-step fashion to 67% of rated performance. That will dampen the stress on the shuttle's zero surfaces as it breaks through the sound barrier. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. We have a go for main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1. Zero. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery as NASA embarks on the final mission to dock with Russia's space station Mir. Here's the Discovery roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. You should now control. Correct. Bye, yeah. Oh, complete Discovery now in the heads down wings level position headed to a 213 nautical mile high orbit inclined 51.6 degrees to either side of the equator. engines now throttling down to 67% of rated thrust as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower part of the atmosphere. T-minus 10, 9, 8, we have a go for engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery with a crew of six astronaut heroes and one American legend. Houston Discovery, roll program. Roger, roll, Discovery. Eleven, ten, nine, eight. We have a go for main engine start. We have main engine start. Four, three, two, one. 
We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour with the first American element of the International Space Station uniting our efforts in space to achieve our common goals. Houston's now controlling. Endeavour's rolling on a course heading northeast from the Kennedy Space Center toward a 240-mile high rendezvous with the Zarya control module. Endeavour already traveling 575 miles per hour, altitude 3 miles, one and a half miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. Three engines on board now throttled down to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure, also uh, called Max-Q. Now activating, T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery first mission to dock with the orbiting International Space Station, and the vehicle has cleared the tower. Space Houston Discovery roll program. Roger, roll Discovery. Houston now controlling, roll maneuver complete, Discovery now in a heads down, wings level position, headed to a 173 nautical mile orbit, inclined 51.6 degrees to either side of the equator. Engines now throttling down to 67% of rated thrust as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure. Three engines now back up at 104%. Go at throttle up. Roger, Houston, go at throttle up. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three. We have a go for engine start. Zero. We have booster ignition and liftoff of Columbia, reaching new heights for women in X-ray astronomy. Houston, Columbia is in the roll. We've got a fuel cell pH number one. Roger, roll, Columbia. We're looking at. Bus sensors off. We're evaluating the fuel cell. Columbia. Hey, that's complete, Scooter. Roger that, Columbia. Looks like we had a transient on AC1. Columbia is now headed down range, altitude 3.8 3 uh, miles. And as we hear, uh, all systems uh, okay. It looks like a sensor on board. Three engines throttling down, all at 67%. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. We have a go for main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery on a mission to repair the Hubble Space Telescope as we venture into the 21st century. Discovery, roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. Houston is now controlling. The roll maneuver is complete. Discovery is now in a heads down position. On course for a 28.5 degree, 310 nautical mile orbit. Discovery's three main engines now are beginning to throttle down to lessen the effects of the dense lower regions of the atmosphere on the orbiter. Discovery already traveling 700 miles per hour, hour, three miles altitude, a little more than a mile downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. Twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven. We have a go for main engine start. Four, three, two, one. 
booster ignition and liftoff of Space Shuttle Endeavour on a 21st century mission placing Earth back on the map. Roger roll, Endeavour. Houston's now controlling. They were rolling on a course northeast away from the Kennedy Space Center toward an orbit that will take it above 95% of the world's population during its mission. Endeavour speed already 300 miles per hour. Altitude one mile. Three engines on Endeavour are now throttling back to two thirds throttle to uh, as the spacecraft prepares to go through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure and uh, go supersonic. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, main engine start, 4, 3, 2, 1, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis, a space shuttle for the 21st century. Houston is now controlling the flight of Atlantis. Roger roll, Atlantis. The roll maneuver is complete. Atlantis is now in a heads down, wings level position, headed toward a rendezvous with the International Space Station. Twenty-eight seconds into the flight, Atlantis's engines are now throttling down to 72% of rated thrust as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure. is currently at an altitude of 3.6 miles, about two and a half miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. All systems on board are performing well. 11, 10, 9, 8, we have a go for main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Atlantis, opening the door to a permanent human presence in space. Roger roll. Houston now controlling the flight of Atlantis. Atlantis completing its roll, placing the shuttle in a heads down wings level position for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Twenty seven seconds into the flight, Atlantis's three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back in a three step fashion to 72 percent of rated performance. That will reduce the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Everything looking very good for Atlantis. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. We have a go for main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery, making shuttle history and building our future in space. Houston now controlling. Houston. Roger roll, Discovery. Discovery's roll maneuver is complete. The orbiter is now in a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 200 statute mile orbit and a rendezvous with the International Space Station Friday afternoon. Three engines aboard Discovery now throttling down as the orbiter prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. Discovery is already traveling 1,000 miles per hour downrange from the launch site, three and a half miles, currently at an altitude of six miles. 12, 11, 10, 9, Eight, we have a go for the engine start. Five, three, two, one. We have booster 
ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour, providing power to the station as we continue to build our future in space. Well, okay. Houston now controlling the flight of Endeavour. Endeavour completing the roll. The shuttle now in a heads-down wings level position for the eight-and-a-half-minute ride to orbit. Twenty-five seconds into the flight, Endeavour's three liquid fuel main engines beginning to throttle back in a three-step fashion to 72% of rated performance. That will reduce the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Endeavour already one and a half miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. All systems reported to be in great shape. 52 seconds into the flight, the main engine's beginning to rev up to full throttle, 104% of rated performance. Endeavour, go at throttle up. 10 seconds. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, go for main engine start, 4, 3, 2, 1, Zero and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis with Destiny, a science laboratory for the 21st century. Houston now controlling. Houston Atlantis, roll program. Roger roll, Atlantis. The roll maneuver is uh, complete aboard Atlantis. The vehicle is now in a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 201 statute mile orbit. Approaching 30 seconds into the flight, uh, preparing to uh, begin throttle down of the main engines as the vehicle prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the orbiter. Seconds into the flight, Atlantis is already downrange from the launch site of two and a half miles at an altitude now of five miles. Atlantis, go at throttle up. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, go for main engine. Four, 3, 2, 1. Liftoff of Discovery and a team of explorers shaping their destiny. Roll program here. Roger, roll Discovery. Houston is now controlling. The roll maneuver is complete and Discovery is now in a heads down, wings level position, carrying the next resident crew to the International Space Station. seconds into the flight. Discovery's engines are now throttling down to 72% of rated thrust as it passes through the area of maximum aerodynamic pressure. Discovery already at an altitude of five and a half miles. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. We have a go for main engine start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour, extending the reach of the space station while extending partnerships above the Earth. Houston Endeavour roll program. Roger roll, Endeavour. Houston's now controlling. Endeavour's rolling on course toward the International Space Station. The shuttle already traveling more than 200 miles per hour. Speed now about 500 miles per hour. Three engines on board the spacecraft are throttling down to two thirds throttle to prepare the shuttle to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Three engines are now throttling back up to full throttle, altitude six miles, speed 900 yeah, miles an hour. Go at throttle up. Inhibits are now removed. Launch ignition system is armed. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1.
and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis, launching a door to partnerships in space. Houston now controlling the flight of Atlantis. Atlantis, Houston, roger roll. Atlantis into the roll, placing the shuttle in a heads down wings level position for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Atlantis beginning its chase of the International Space Station, a 42 hour pursuit of the facility. Seven seconds into the flight, Atlantis's three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back in a three-step fashion to 72% of rated performance, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Twelve, eleven, two minus ten, nine, eight, seven, six. We have the engine start. Three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery, carrying the third crew of astronaut presidents to the International Space Station. Booster Discovery, roll program. Roger, roll, Discovery. Houston is now controlling. The roll maneuver is complete, and Discovery is now in a heads down, wings level position, carrying the next resident crew to the International Space Station. seconds into the flight and Discovery's three main engines are beginning to throttle back to 74% of rated thrust as Discovery passes through maximum aerodynamic pressure. Go for main engine start. Six, five, four, three, two, one. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavor, pushing our goals skyward using our station in space. Houston now controlling the flight of Endeavor. Roll program. Roger roll, Endeavor. Endeavour into the roll, placing the shuttle in a heads-down wings level position, the proper azimuth for the eight-and-a-half-minute ride to orbit. Thirty seconds into the flight, Endeavour's three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back in a three-step fashion to 72% of rated performance, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Endeavour already three miles downrange, four and a half miles in altitude, losing weight as it heads uphill. Endeavour, Houston, go at throttle up. T minus ten, nine, eight, seven, six, eight, four, three, two, one, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Columbia to broaden our view of the universe through the Hubble Space Telescope. Houston now controlling the flight of Columbia, the Pioneer shuttle headed for the Hubble Space Telescope. Roll program. Roger roll, Columbia. Columbia into the roll, placing the shuttle in a heads down wings level position for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. 25 seconds into the flight, Columbia's three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back in a three step fashion to 72% of rated performance, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Already two miles in altitude, one and a half miles downrange, leaving an incandescent trail behind it. Columbia headed for Hubble, Hubble almost directly over the Cape at this moment. Three engines now uh, throttling down, uh, soon to throttle back up to 104% of rated performance. The main engines, along with the three fuel cells and three hydraulic power units, all functioning normally. 12, 11, 10, Nine, eight, we have a go for main engine start. Six, five, four, three, two, 
one. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Atlantis setting in place the keystone to the space station's backbone. Atlantis roll program. Roger rolled, Atlantis. Houston's now controlling Atlantis rolling on course toward the International Space Station. Atlantis already traveling more than 300 miles per hour. Altitude now two miles, downrange about one mile from the launch pad. Three engines on board Atlantis have throttled back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Atlantis, Houston, go at throttle up. 10, seconds. Ten nine, eight, seven. We have a go for main engine start. Five, three, two, one. Zero. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour, extending our reach while expanding our research in space. Houston now controlling the flight of Endeavour. Three new residents headed for the International Space Station. Endeavour completing its roll, 51.6 degrees inclined to the equator. The shuttle heads down wings level for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. 37 seconds into the flight, three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back in a three-step fashion to 72% of rated performance. That will reduce the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Endeavour Houston, go at throttle up. Eleven. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. We have both main engines start. Two. One. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Atlantis, building the station and our future in space. Houston now controlling the flight of Atlantis. Roger roll, Atlantis. Atlantis into the roll, the external tank camera placing the shuttle in a heads down wing, wings level position for that eight and a half minute ride to orbit. The Florida Space Coast disappearing as uh, Atlantis moves into the correct azimuth for orbit. Thirty-three seconds into the flight. First condensation pouring over the top of the orbiter as the three liquid fuel main engines begin to throttle back in a three-step fashion to 72% of rated performance. Forty-nine seconds into the flight, Atlantis already two and a half miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center, throttling up. You are go and throttle up. T minus ten, nine. Eight, seven, six, go for main engine start. Two, one, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Endeavour, another building block for the foundation of the International Space Station. Houston now controlling the flight of Endeavour, three new residents headed for the International Space Station. Endeavour completing the roll, the shuttle now in a heads down wings level position for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Endeavour's three liquid fuel main engines throttling back now in a three step fashion to 72% of rated performance, reducing the stress on the orbiter as it breaks through the sound barrier. Five seconds into the flight, the main engine soon to begin to rev up to full throttle, 104% of rated performance. The main engines, along with the three fuel cells and three hydraulic power units, all functioning normally. Endeavour Houston, go at throttle up. Go at throttle up. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. We have a go for main engine start. 5, 4, 3, 2, 
one. We have booster ignition and liftoff of Space Shuttle Columbia with a multitude of national and international space research experiments. Houston now controlling the flight of Columbia, the international research mission finally underway. Roger, roll Columbia. Com Columbia now rolling on to the proper azimuth for a 39 degree inclination to orbit. Shuttle in a heads down wings level position for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. 30 seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines beginning to throttle back in a three-step fashion to 72% of rated performance, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Columbia already two and a half miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center, four and a half miles in altitude, the main engines beginning to rev up to full throttle, 104% of rated performance. Bring safe systems on. T minus 10 seconds. Go for main engine start. Seven, six, five, three engines up and burning. Three, two, one, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery, beginning America's new journey to the moon, Mars, and beyond. And the vehicle has cleared the tower. Discovery's rolling onto a course for rendezvous with the International Space Station. Discovery's already traveling at 400 miles per hour. Altitude 12,000 feet. This a view from a camera mounted on Discovery's external fuel tank. Three engines on Discovery are now throttling down to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. One minute since launch, Discovery speed now 900 miles per hour. Discovery 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Go for main engine start. Main engine start. 2, 1, booster ignition and liftoff of the space shuttle Discovery returning to the space station, paving the way for future missions beyond. Throttled back to 67% of rated performance, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Discovery already three and a half miles in altitude, one and a half miles downrange, traveling almost 750 miles an hour. Everything looking good on the bird. 57 seconds into the flight, engines beginning to rev up. Minus 10, 9, 8. Seven, six, five, three main engines up and burning. Two, one, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis, opening in a new chapter in the completion of the International Space Station for the collaboration of nations in space. Roger, roll, Atlantis. Houston is now controlling. Roll maneuver is underway. Atlantis is heading into a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 137 by 36 statute mile orbit. Atlantis already two miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center at an altitude of 2.8 statute miles. Engines now at 72% beginning to throttle back up as the vehicle passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. 
10 seconds. We have a go for main engine start. Six, four, three, two, one. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery lighting up the nighttime sky as we continue building the International Space Station. Space Station. Speed of 1,000 miles an hour, altitude of one mile, downrange of four and a half miles from Kennedy Space Center already. Three good engines, startling back to two thirds of the radius thrust. Passing the air at maximum dynamic pressure, about to go supersonic. Here's a view from the external tank camera. Discovery Houston, go and throttle up. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, main engine start. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis to assemble the framework for the science laboratories of tomorrow. Houston now controlling. Houston Atlantis, roll program. Roger, roll Atlantis. Atlantis's roll maneuver is complete. The uh, orbiter's in a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 137 by 36 statute mile orbit. All systems in good shape. Engines throttling down as Atlantis prepares to maneuver through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower air atmosphere. Already seven miles away from the Kennedy Space Center at an altitude of five miles. Houston, Atlantis, go and throttle up. T minus ten, nine, eight, seven, six, go for main engine start. Four, three, two, one, zero, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Endeavour, expanding the International Space Station while creating a classroom in space. Houston Endeavour, roll program. Roger, roll Endeavour. Houston now controlling the flight of Endeavour. The Space Shuttle begins its journey back into orbit. Endeavour rolling onto the proper alignment, heads down, wings level for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Taking aim on the International Space Station for docking on Friday. 30 seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines will soon throttle back to 72% of rated performance in the bucket to reduce the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. This view from long-range trackers, now from a camera on the external fuel tank showing the bird's eye view of Endeavour heading towards space. 54 seconds into the flight, Endeavour already eight miles downrange, standing by for the throttle up call from Capcom, Chris Ferguson. T minus 16 seconds, sound suppression water system has been activated, protecting Discovery and the launch pad from acoustical energy. We have a go for main engine start, T minus five, four, three, two, one, booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery hoisting harmony to the heavens and opening new gateways for international science. Discovery has cleared the tower. Houston now controlling. Roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. Discovery's roll maneuver is complete. It's now in a head down position on track for its flight to the International Space Station. Discovery seven miles downrange at an altitude of two statute miles. Flying at 600 miles per hour. Discovery's engines are throttling down as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum pressure on the vehicle. Now 50 seconds into the flight. Rain safety systems armed. 
Sound suppression system, water activated. T minus 10, 9, 8, go for maintenance to start. 7, 6, main engine ignition. 4, 3, 2, 0, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis as Columbus sets sail on a voyage of science to the space station. Houston now controlling. Roger, roll, Atlantis. Columbus weighs anchor from its port in Florida. Atlantis on the proper alignment, heads down, wings level for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit, taking aim on the International Space Station for docking on Saturday. 28 seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines soon will throttle back to 72% of rated performance, going in the bucket, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Atlantis three miles in altitude, seven miles downrange. 50 seconds into the flight, the engines beginning to throttle back up, standing by for that call from Capcom Jim Dutton. Rain safety systems armed. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, and lift off of Endeavour going where east and west do meet at the International Space Station. Houston now controlling. Houston Endeavour, roll program. Roger, roll Endeavour. The roll maneuver is complete. Endeavour is in a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 136 by 36 statute mile orbit. The Florida coast gets an early sunrise as Endeavour heads out on a course to intercept the International Space Station in a day and a half. We have go for main engine start. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Shuttle Discovery. Combate Kudasai. Best of luck to the International Space Station's newest laboratory. Houston and Discovery roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. Houston now controlling the flight of Discovery, a man-made rising sun on behalf of Japan. Discovery on the proper alignment, heads down, wings level for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Four and a half million pounds of hardware and humans taking aim on the International Space Station. Thirty-six seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back to 72% of rated performance, going in the bucket, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it goes supersonic. Discovery already five miles in altitude, eight and a half miles downrange, traveling almost a thousand miles an hour. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Space Shuttle Endeavour, preparing our home in space for a larger international family. Houston now controlling. Houston Endeavour roll program. Roger roll, Endeavour. Commander Chris Ferguson confirming Endeavour is rolling on course for a rendezvous with the International Space Station. Feet a thousand miles an hour, altitude one mile, downrange distance six and a half miles from Kennedy Space Center already. down to 72% of the rated thrust as the shuttle goes through the realm of maximum aerodynamic pressure. Altitude 5 miles, downrange 8 miles from Kennedy Space Center. Speed 1,500 miles an hour. Endeavor, go at throttle up. All systems remain go. 12, 10, 
Let's just go for main engine start. Six, five, four, three, two, one. And booster ignition and liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery, taking the space station to full power for full science. This is Mission Control Houston. Discovery roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. Discovery's roll maneuver is complete. It is now in a heads down position on track for its flight to the International Space Station. Discovery flying 365 miles per hour, one and, a half, one and a half miles in altitude, seven miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. Discovery's engines are throttling down as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum pressure on the vehicle. Minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 4, 3, 2, 1, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis, a final visit to enhance the vision of Hubble into the deepest grandeur of our universe. Bypass across the board, scooter, no action. Houston now controlling Atlantis on its way. Atlantis on its way, all three engines now throttling down as the area begins as the vehicle passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Atlantis Houston, no action on the MPS H2 out P. Houston, we copy, no action. Atlantis, go at throttle up. The sound suppression water system has been activated, protecting Endeavour and the launch pad from acoustical energy. We're go for main engine start. We have main engine start. Four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Endeavour, completing Kibo and fulfilling Japan's hope for an out-of-this-world space laboratory. Houston, Endeavour, roll program. Roger, roll, Endeavour. This is Mission Control Houston. Endeavour's roll maneuver is being completed. It's now going into a heads-down position on track for its flight to the International Space Station. Flying at 400 miles per hour, one mile in altitude, and seven miles downrange already from the Kennedy Space Center. Endeavour's engines were throttle throttling down as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum pressure on the vehicle. Now 50 seconds into the flight. We have a go for main engine start. We have a go for main engine start. Main engine start. Two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery. Celebrating its 25th birthday by racking up science and supplies to the space station. Houston now controlling the midnight ride of Rick Sterko and his crew to the International Space Station. Discovery rolling onto the proper alignment for its eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Four and a half million pounds of hardware and humans taking aim on the international outpost. Thirty-two seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines soon will throttle back to 72 percent of rated performance down in the bucket, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it goes transonic. Discovery three and a half miles in altitude, four miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. Standing by for the throttle up call now from Capcom Eric Bowe. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5.
liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis on a mission to build, resupply, and to do research on the International Space Station. Houston now controlling. Atlantis begins its penultimate journey to shore up the International Space Station. Atlantis now in the proper alignment for its eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Four and a half million pounds of hardware and humans taking aim on the International Outpost. 30 seconds into the flight, Atlantis almost two miles in altitude, almost six miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center already, traveling 500 miles an hour. The three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back to 72% of rated performance, going into the bucket, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. 55 seconds into the flight, all systems operating normally, 900 miles an hour. The speed of Atlantis right now, six miles in altitude, nine miles downrange. We're T minus 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. We have to go for ready to start. Two, one, zero. Booster ignition and liftoff of Shuttle Endeavour with NASA's final space station crew compartment that brings a bay window view to our celestial backyard. Mission Control Houston, Endeavour's roll maneuver is complete. It's now in a heads down position on track for its flight to the International Space Station. 28 seconds into the flight, Endeavour flying at 1100 miles per hour, 1.3 miles in altitude, and 7 miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center according to onboard computers. Endeavour's engines are throttling down at the, as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum pressure on the vehicle. Endeavour, go at throttle up. Endeavour copies, go at throttle up. T-minus 15 seconds and the sound suppression water system has been activated. We have a go for main engine start. Three engines up and ready. Three, two, one, zero. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery. Blazing a trail to scientific discoveries aboard space station. Houston Discovery roll program. Right, to roll Discovery. Discovery is rolling into a heads down position, putting it on course for 51.6 degree, 136 by 36 statute line orbit, and eventually the International Space Station. Discovery's three liquid fueled main engines are now throttling down to reduce stress on the shuttle as it travels through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Discovery is already at an altitude of 4.7 miles or 26,500 feet. Firing chain is armed, sound suppression water system activated. T minus 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. Go for main engine start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And zero and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis crest of its historic achievements in space. And Houston Atlantis is in a roll. Roger, roll. Houston is now controlling. The roll maneuver is complete. Atlantis is in a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 136 by 36 statute mile orbit. Three main engines on Atlantis have now been throttled down to 72% of rated thrust as the orbiter prepares to pass through the uh, area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. The engine's now beginning to throttle back up. Go for main engine start. We have main engine start. Two. 
one. Booster ignition and the final liftoff of Discovery. A tribute to the dedication, hard work, and pride of America's space shuttle team. The shuttle has cleared the tower. This is Mission Control Houston, the space shuttle now rolling over onto its back for the 8th minute ride into orbit. Discovery now making one last reach for the stars. down as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum pressure, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it goes supersonic. Discovery Houston, you are go at throttle up. System is armed. Go for main engine start. Eight, seven, six. Four, three, two, zero, and liftoff for the final launch of Endeavour. Expanding our knowledge, expanding our lives in space. Houston Endeavour, roll program. Roger, roll, Endeavour. Houston is now controlling. Endeavour beginning to over onto its uh, back, the roll program underway as uh, Endeavour begins the heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 136 by 36 statute mile orbit. Three engines now throttling down as Endeavour uh, passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. Approaching one minute into the flight. Firing chain is armed. 15. Go for main engine start. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. All three engines up and burning. 2, 1. Zero and lift off the final lift off of Atlantis on the shoulders of the space shuttle. America will continue the dream. Roger roll, Atlantis. Houston now controlling the flight of Atlantis. The space shuttle spreads its wings one final time for the start of a sentimental journey into history. 24 seconds into the flight, roll program complete. Atlantis now heads down, wings level on the proper alignment for its eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Four and a half million pounds of hardware and humans taking aim on the International Space Station. 40 seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines throttling back to 72% of rated performance in the bucket, reducing stress on the shuttle as it goes transonic for the final time. Engines now revving up, standing by for the throttle up call. 